Uh, so this is, it's called The Chosen Spot. It's, the music for it has been uh, under works for about a year and a half. And now I'm currently preparing for a performance for it as well. Uh, it's called The Chosen Spot because my hometown is called Canandaigua. And that's a Native American word that when you translate it, it means the chosen spot. The theme of this is... Hmm, this is weird to think through on the spot. It's, uh, it's... I don't know how to describe it. There, it's a collection of just things that I got from my hometown while I'm away and I'm just hearing all these like people dying and crazy shit and I grew up in a place and understood it as like this like serene ideal place and then now it feels weird to go back to and it feels like a totally different place and it's there's a lot of change going on and it's kind of weird to think about how it kind of reflects change that I'm going through but also change that this place that like was kind of sacred was going through and now it's it just seems kind of gross. A part of me thinks that if you're not pushing new ground and trying new things and like challenging yourself or others when you're making art, if you're just making stuff just because it's popular, I don't I personally don't find value in that. So this performance, I'm hoping that everyone who comes is like, I don't know what that was. But I hope that it's like an immersive experience is what I'm aiming for. I want it to be full of surprises. It's gonna be, it features the music that I've created, but it also features footage and uh, parts of other disciplines that hopefully will kind of shed new light on what a performance can be and what it should be. I don't think that it should be something that you just go there and stand there and watch at people thrash around. I think that it should kind of make you think.